All right, welcome back to more Alone in the Dark. Thank you guys for joining me on this series, and let's get straight into it. Okay, we got a pallet knife. Reflections on the Power of the Verb in Certain Texts by Juan Luis Jorge. To act is in itself divine. Even the slightest movement of our hand is evidence of our soul in motion. Yet our free will is so easily overwhelmed by the dullness of everyday life. And we got a key, we're just getting stuck. Oh, okay, this is that room. Why? There's like something invisible here. Okay, so oh. now we can... The Barlow Lens. Instructions. To double the magnification of your telescope, simply fit this Barlow Lens to your instrument. Now we can move those wedges from the doors. Cellar key. I don't have everything I need. Yeah, we need some sort of lens. So let's try and access those doors. But we have the tool. It worked. Okay, shortcut. This is every bean in here. Yeah, I believe so. We just need to look for the doors that have the wedges in them. Here, can to open that one. We can unlock it with the key. Come on, Grace. I'm too tired for games. I'll even let you play with my jackknife. Oh, good evening. <laughs> you haven't seen a little girl by any chance, have you? I don't think so. Uh, you would have known if you did. The only kid crazy enough to be in this place. She's not in her room then? <laughs> that would be a first. Always running around causing trouble. It's very hard to pin down that one. You want to sit up? I'm good, thank you. Well, I should be going then. Mm. Unless there's anything you need from me. I just want to find my uncle before anything happens to him. Oh, don't worry, miss. He'll show up. <laughs> he is much too little liver to kill himself. Why would he? <laughs> it's his greatest ambition, didn't you know? Take care now. Nah. 
So this is Grace's room. Don't you worry, Grace. Go play your game, bleat and bellow with the others. I won't be jealous. There will be more masquerades. However, I would love it if you would finish my mask for the feast. With love, Ruth. Cute. Some freaky dolls. Wait, is there something more here? Oh, you can actually take it. There's weird ass mirrors again. seen this somewhere. This must be the great Cassandra Beauregard's room. I'm not sure what I expected. Maybe something more extravagant? What's that? I'm not sure. I need something else. Miss Beauregard, I picked up your medicine at the post office today. As you understand, it needs to be administered by the orderlies for your safety. I have put the box in Lottie's room for now, and I'm sure she will find you as soon as possible. All right. Oh, I guess I put the bottle down. There's a fourth one. I'm not sure I have everything I need. Is the bottle in here? There is something hidden in here. I can feel it. Maybe on this big painting. Something missing. Let me check Grace's room once more. Yeah, nothing. Okay. I guess downstairs there might be something. I can't Let's leave. See. I need to find Jeremy. Yeah, I know. I need the key. Cellar door key. Okay, we need to go into the cellar. Then. We're in the cellar. That can't be unlocked. I 
I need the key. That's not the cellar. I think the cellar is actually... Yeah, let me go down here. This might be a longer chapter than usual. Up here then. Wait, that's another door. Okay, we can't use that door. These are steps, but we can't use them. Nothing in there. How about this door? Okay, so we use this door. Right, and we're looking at the lens. Now this will come in handy. It's blocked. Oh, okay, we can't go through that one. What the f go in there. That's the thing. Let me get my shotgun ready. It's blocked. Here we go. They're gonna spawn right behind us. Wait. Come on, come on. Right, I have a melee weapon, I keep on forgetting. I feel like I'm trying not to use those, because otherwise I'm going to be screwed. So bad. Okay, that doesn't open that. Let's just drink some of that. Oh, there's something here. No, it's just a glass. Is the cellars here? Yeah, I think we get it close. What's that stain? Looks like some. You know, Mr. Waits, I saw a piece of the plate that Liza broke. I think she's been hiding them. She's not very good at it. She just chucked it into the little room with all the tools behind the boiler. I left it there. I didn't want to embarrass her by picking it up while she was looking. 
kind of rod. All right. It's another one of those plates for the telescope. It's also broken yeah, in this Yeah, those plates. Okay, it's not gonna let me open that. We have a cellar key. Maybe that means this. Didn't use the keys yet. Alright, right here. Switch. This works too. Yeah, that's not turning back on. We know something's going to pop up. Right there. Uh, dude, you okay? <gasps> what the hell is that? What? There was a dead body in here. Did I just imagine that? There, upstairs, maybe we're missing something. Been through that door, what about this one? Wait. 
definitely haven't been here. that door. Do you teach piano as well? Did you teach those clawing Casano kids how to play the piano? How do you know about that? Just because grown-ups don't notice children doesn't mean we don't notice you. Yes, I taught them some piano. Are you any good at it? Not good enough to play a broken one. It fell from the attic, brought half the ceiling down. It was Jeremy's fault, wasn't it? Nobody knows what happened, but you're not wrong. Kid freaking stabbed us, man. What was she trying to inject? door. Ugh. There's more of that unsettling rot. On the commonplace of evil, there lies virtue and stark irreverence. Okay, we got that. And nothing on that table. Oh, okay, so that's a shortcut there. But what exactly was in there? Okay, so now we got the the other bottle. We need to get back to that room, which is where through here.
Uh, no, actually, it's it's Grace's room. Grace's room is upstairs. Couldn't we go through? It's not here, but I'll just check something. Yeah, there's nothing here. We could go through into that other room. We could go through here, but now there's a bunch of carpets there. Wait, which one is... Okay, wait, hold on. Hold on. This game playing with me, man. Yeah, over here. This is Grace's room. I got confused because they look similar. You know, we can put the medicine... Maybe it has something to do with the patients. Okay, you can rotate them.
Okay. I'm still trying to figure it out. Maybe there's something... Okay, wait, let me, let me look at the bottom. this here oh look at that did something let's write this down numbers on the bottle. Okay. Two five one four. Two five seven. Two five and seven. So Pisces, Gemini and Leo, I'm guessing. for Pisces again. Okay, I got that one. Gemini 2 and then... There we go. Okay, I figured it out. We gotta go... we have to get back to the solo. I get to the cellar, I go... Uh, I think I go through here. It's like by some stairs. store I think it is yep okay and then we put in the broken plate now we need to make the pattern I think we actually have a picture of this okay church with the Sun countryside. Peace goes here. Clouds go up top. 
sun goes here. This should go up top as well. This can go there. This has come here. Okay, I think we got it. Now the talisman numbers, oh god. Put it in the right order. Seven is the K9 is the biggest, so it's nine, seven, five. Nine, seven, five. Is this correct? Yep, it's correct. Talisman is showing another room. Something is open. So we're in the cemetery. And it's pretty dark. How do I... Yep, there we go. Flashlight. Alright, now we got the smooth picture over there. being very careful I don't wanna she was okay that's just some branches so far this game it's is like a, a blend since I visited the family tomb I hope it's in a better state than the real world it's like a blend between horror and Like those games, or what are those games? Uh, like Until Dawn and stuff like that. But this is more engaging, I guess. That's at least how I feel about it. Alright, we got some bullets. The blessing. What's this? Oh, wait, what's that? It's pretty dark. Oh, 
Oh, okay, I put it in the door. What's that for? There we go. Ah, too easy. We're gonna fight something, aren't we? Okay. Ah, uh, here we go. I know what the fuck is that. Uh, how do I? Yep. Just. Let's just be a little quiet about this. Oh, we put this the medallions the in here. Book. It looks like I need more medallions to open it. All right. I'm not sure I have everything I need. Anyway, just it's a, it's a gun. It took three. Oh, my God. Okay, no, 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 no. okay, it's dead. What the hell is more? Okay, we might need to switch to the shotgun here. Yeah, let me load it. As for bullets, we have no bullets. We have no melee weapons, so we're gonna struggle a little bit here. Is it bullets? No. Okay, those are bullets. Let me load it in. Wait, what? Oh, it's shotgun bullets. Shotgun shells. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm sneaking. Okay, we got a weapon, so we're pretty, pretty much safe from that. Bullets, let me load them. Keep on going, keep on going. the woods yet or, or the cemetery we're in the cemetery now <sighs> uh, 
that like why this is meant to be like a molotov cocktail were there meant to be molotov cocktails in this game if they were that's kind of disappointing that they're not here because i keep on seeing them all around She has a lighter, doesn't she? Yeah, something is not right here. Something ain't right. And I don't like it. Oh, there's the other one. Okay, hold on. Let's not get excited here. Because we know what happens when we get excited. Hmm. Yeah, boy. What? You too? Oh, sorry. No moss, man, no moss. All right, that's the way out. What is that? Definitely gonna need that. Of course. Load. Load the gun. Now there's two of them. Meh. Carry out a damn bullets. Asshole, get down. Okay, we're, we're good. We also didn't get hurt there, so I that's good. Yes, I understand. I'm telling you, man, those are meant to be Molotov cocktails. That'd be so handy. Okay, so where did they come from? Here? Oh, you gotta rotate them. I'm guessing, nope, hold on down. Okay, swap. Okay.
Oh, what? Hey, you can't do that. Oh, shit. Nope. Nope. Oh, that's some bullshit, man. Nah. Okay, so I just got molested by those things. I'm just going straight for it, man. I'm, I'm skipping. Now we going, we going. We are going, man. What the hell? What the hell is this section? Okay, I died again. I don't know what's going on, man. What is this section? Okay, we can't go there, so we go here, we go around in. See, she gets stuck. She gets stuck in enemies. Oh, she's getting stuck on the ground. That, that problem, man. Okay, let me, let me get the shotgun out. I don't know what this game's doing, man. I don't know, left. Right, doesn't matter. Okay, we're out. That section, I don't know, man. But there's the other medallion. There we go. Okay. <sighs> I made it out. Now all we have to do is just put the thing in the thing. That here. And of course, they are not in the right order. Uh, I think I get it. I think I get it. There we go.
Emma, is that you? Jeremy. What are you doing here? But you sounded so miserable in your letter. I've come to take you away from here. I can't believe I made such a foolish mistake. All I wanted was for you to stay away. What do you mean? I bargained with the dark man. A pact to keep New Orleans safe with my own life as tribute. The dark man isn't real, Jeremy. There is nothing he can do to hurt you. How do you think any of this is happening? How do you still not trust my words? Fine. Then let me help. Don't be foolish. He will bury you next to me in his sunken temple for an eternity. I don't care. I'll find a way. I have my own talisman, and I know about Tarawea. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Don't speak. Who's in here? Show yourself. You know who, Emma? They took your grandfather. No, I mean it. Who's in here? I can feel someone's in here. Tarawea, why do you want to go there, Jeremy? I've seen so many strange occurrences lately. Memories explode into existence and then burn out like tie glass bulb filaments. Dreamscapes crash down from the stars and sink into the sea. Doors that lead to nowhere and absolutely everywhere at once. With all this reverie, I want to think there's a chance that you found a way to remain alive in some way I cannot fathom. Just like I've learned to navigate with my talisman, maybe you, with all your knowledge, you somehow knew a way, a way to find me again, perhaps in Tarawaya. Oh, my love, Jeremy. I need to find out more about Jeremy's pact with the Dark Man. He meant to go to Tarawaya. Maybe there is something there that would help. She was beautiful. I wonder what happened to her. Uh, okay, I have no idea what the hell is going on in the story. But I'm kind of interested. That's kind of what keep, keeps me playing. I'm just honestly confused. Okay, so let's, uh... Ferocious fate remained a mystery to Emily. Was she a part of Jeremy's story? Or did she maybe have her own? Okay, we need to unlock Jeremy's steamer trunk. That would be in his room. Might be across here. No, that's locked. Okay, I'm using the map. Jeremy had found a way to enter Tarawea. So we are in the grand parlor. We need to go through the dining room. That's the stairs, Lottie's room. Oh, we have to go to the library. More parlor. Okay, so we're here. That means we need to go through this door. through here we need to go through the library and then through this door
Looks like we got a puzzle here. Okay, this needs to go here. This needs to go here. And needs to go not there. Here. I think it makes a circle type of shape. Oh wait, this must go here, this must... I mean, this must be swapped. Here, there we go, I got it. 9, 4, 1. Wait, what's going on? It's entering the numbers by itself? Okay. Great, so where is that? Uh, okay, so we're, we're back. We need to go to the dining room. That's outside the dining room. Wait, what? Where is the... Okay, dining room. There should be a fireplace here. That's where we need to go. Really so. Now, what do we need to do? Oh, okay. should not have come, Emily. How do you know my name? Have we met? In a manner of speaking. As a manifestation of Yermi's deepest desires, I am to you unfamiliar. Yet I know of you. Are you Jeremy? Is that what you're saying? I am only his subconscious thoughts. I cannot speak for his totality. How come you have a Spanish accent? And what is this place? Is this Tarawea? This is indeed the fabled convent of Tarawea, where Yermi goes to find peace during his sessions with Dr. Gray. It's all fantasy then. Based on the things he has read and seen. And that includes you? Yes. My name is Juan Luis Jorge. Yermi once read a book of mine. It stuck with him. Can you help me break the pact with the Dark Man so we can leave Dorsetto? Yermi doesn't want you to. He wants to honor his word to the Dark Man. Why? What's the point? I don't understand what the pact is for. The people of Derseto are calling upon evil to enter this world. Your uncle offered his soul to the Dark Man to contain this disaster. What? No, that doesn't make any sense. The pact will be fulfilled at dawn. As the sun rises, Yermi will forever be entombed in his sunken desert temple. As promised, the Dark Man shall quarantine 
and starve the evil inside their Seto. What about all the patients and the staff? They will not stand the chance. That's unacceptable. How could Jeremy agree to this? Desperation, of course. Jeremy did not choose martyrdom lightly. Well, nothing is lost yet. I'm sure I can find a way to break the pact and save Jeremy, and hopefully the people at Dorsetto. What even is this evil you're talking about? I don't know much. I think some nightmarish entity from the bayou. I'll just have to deal with that later. First, I have to get Jeremy out of his deal. What? Did you run out of arguments? You're actually quite inspiring, Miss Emily. If we put Jeremy's feelings aside, I would have to say I agree with you. Really? You might just be able to save the old man from himself. I think you should take a look in the convent library. Try to find the truth about Yermi's relationship with the Dark Man. Okay. You should know that you won't be alone in those grand halls. The Dark Man has been reading those books for years. He's... here? You'll have to be very careful. Of course. I... I can be careful. Good luck, Miss Emily. Okay, so we're actually in chapter three now, for real. I'm going to make this chapter pretty long so we can get ahead. Uh, where do we go? Go wherever. All right, little neat looking place. I wonder what's with these statues. There's something missing. endless, beautiful, and terrible, an Akashic record for the universe inside the mind of Jeremy Hotwood, now corrupted by a story forced upon him, told by a maniacal liar, an evil conjured by science and secrecy. I will suspend a room and lock away the foundation of his character, its key will be left to the librarian, the only thing invisible to the Prowler. There's another step. They placed in such awkward areas. 
be another one. Okay, we can go through there and check if there's bullets here. Any resources? Yeah, there's something. Oh, here's a cross. try and shoot the dark man you shoot yourself there's something missing here's a ladder or maybe it just it works with the case okay, so and we take the cross. This is difficult.
Um, okay. I meant to get on the other side. Use that. We just go on the whatever that elevator. It was in the hot autumn that I went through the night with the restless crowd. He was a kind of itinerant showman who held forth in public halls and aroused widespread fear. The New Orleans address of the event is lost, but I remember distinctly the Prext Shipping Company pressing their contribution. Emily! No going back. He's in my head, Juan. His breath replacing mine. You should not have come, Emily. my new best friend come join me for some giggle water ah Ruth oh Miss Hartwood don't tell me you've been out swinging without me Ruth what is this place where are we have you never been to the Maccabean before goodness me tell me Miss Hartwood have you ever considered going out for an evening? Are we in New Orleans? Oh, who can tell anymore? I just went inside the Grand Parlor and suddenly here I am. The Grand Parlor? Can I get back to Dorsetto from here? <laughs> Are you sure you want to? We could stay here and drink the night away. How about a gin fizz? If this is New Orleans, maybe I should go further. Find that magic show the book was talking about. But there was no address, just Preg's shipping company. Oh, is this about where Jeremy met the dark man? How do you know about that? <laughs> Jeremy talked a lot about the dark man. I always felt a bit envious. How so? If an all-powerful entity showed me any interest, I'd at least hear him out. I'm sure he has plenty to offer. I don't think you'd want that, Ruth. We're too sweet for such darkness. <laughs> oh, please. What kind of blue nose do you take me for? I relish the darkness. I think it suits me. <laughs> <laughs> you don't happen to know how to find the Preg's shipping company, do you? Of course. Their office is just over there. Whoa, what happened? You just got lucky. <laughs> A bientôt, Mamselle Emily. Hey, do you know where my uncle is? No, but I bet you're close. Got a match book. It was in the hot autumn that I went through the night with the restless crowds to witness the enigmatic Black Pharaoh. He was a kind of itinerant showman who held forth in public halls and aroused widespread fear wherever he performed. 
Craig's right. shipping company. According to the book in the Great Library, they assisted a showman performing somewhere in New Orleans. It's somehow connected to Jeremy's introduction to the Dark Man. I'm sure I can find the address inside. Here's another one. Oh, here we go. You can actually throw them. Crack. But it doesn't light on fire. It's locked from the other side. I don't know where to go. I low on health? Oh yeah, I was low on health. Probably why Emily looks like that. <laughs> Take this, you bastard. Oh, there we go, lights on fire. Ah, oh, crap. Just go, just go, just go. There was something there, a key. Oh, come on, why are they heavy?
game cheating you know? Maybe I can move all that junk out of the way with the crew. Go! It's getting frustrating. Oh boy. Take this. Yeah, how you like me now, huh? Let's make sure I'm reloaded here. Ooh, it's dark. Dark in here. There's nothing here, there's always something here. Yeah. Alright, I made it inside the warehouse. Now let's find that address.
fire poker. That thing is probably in here. Anywhere. This is getting ridiculous. I mean, I'm not complaining. Tommy Gun. See this here, mister? Our ship was raided while in dock. All of his things were recovered, but blood was shed. Several men were carried into the Mississippi River and drowned by ones who live in the deep. All items have now been signed and delivered. Now let's keep the papers safe. What is left? Later is right. And hell is back again. Uh, let me just check that. Okay, we need to open this. We're gonna need the password. Leave call. Where do we get that? Find out. Next time. Yep, we're, we're still gonna be playing this. Oh, let's see, we got a. Check that door. Yeah, you can't go in there. So that means the password is somewhere here. It's hidden somewhere. Mississippi River. I don't think there's anything there. Any notes, maybe? Wait, so, oh, okay, hold on, hold on. What is left is bright and hell is back again. That's right. Okay, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Let me let me think about it. Chip is several men. All items have been signed and delivered now. This kid. Peter. Oh. I'm just not understanding what he means. What is left? Hmm. 
maybe it has something to do. Okay. This. This is a six. Three, four, five. Going one, two, three, four. Four. Five, four. All right. Gotta go manifesto. September 19th, 1892. Black Shipping Company delivered four steamer trunks, one Egyptian sarcophagus, and a large wooden crate belonging to the showman called the Black Pharaoh, performing at Gaitin Street. This is it. The address to the theater where Jeremy first met the Dark Man. All right, well, let's get out of here. Better not be any bullshit. Ah, uh, mother try. I knew it. Bullshit is here. Come on. I got my tummy gun. Leave me alone. I got a tummy gun. Instinct, ultra instinct, come on. It is giving me bullshit, guys. The game is giving me bullshit. With my tummy gun. Like this, huh? Like that? Looks like the fog cleared up. shouldn't have come 
Don't say that. You needed my help. All I wanted was to keep people away from Dissetto. Especially you, Emily. You're the only one in the family who forgave me for choosing old age over death. Father still cares for you? He is paying for your treatment at Dersetto. To get rid of me! That's the only reason anyone's at Dersetto. Someone in the family thought you were becoming an embarrassment. Help me get you out of this mess, Jeremy. I want to take you away. Your father would send me right back. What if I take you up north? To Kingsport. I know Mother still has family up there. I've been thinking about going for a while now. I haven't been to Massachusetts in years. I still paint from memory, you know. That old lighthouse makes for a great motif. Your father and I would go almost every summer. Then when our great uncle died, we stopped going back. What is there to be done about the dark man? He's the one holding you back, right? You feel like you can't leave without paying your debt to him. The dark man has been with me since I was 12 years old. He was standing right on that stage right over there. For a brief moment, his gaze held mine. And that was it. I recognized him for what he was. The heart would guys embodied in flesh. I thought it was my turn. But I was only there to be mocked. Instead, his attention moved on to my father sitting next to me. I turned to him and saw his face. The whitest shade of pale I've ever seen. He bit off his tongue that night and suffocated. What can be done, Jeremy? Please. There's a way. Two ways, to be exact. One worse than the other. A written contract, now buried inside his sunken temple. Don't you remember what it said? <gasps> I don't want to. Try, Jeremy. What did the contract say? No, we can't. We can't let Wallen suffer that blight. I have to make this sacrifice. What are you talking about? Is this the thing from the bayou? Juan said something. Ah! Okay, so there is a way to break the pact at least. Hidden somewhere inside the dark man's temple. I just need to find it somehow. I'm just fooling around. Okay, we don't...
Wait, are there symbols in there? There are some. I'm not sure. Wait a minute, over there. I recognize that. But there's only two of them. Maybe the third one we can guess. Oh. It's two and the thing. We need to check. Do you like items have Chapter. Uh, there's my stuff. Family Bibles. I need the thing. Here we go. You do. So I need the, the Gemini. It is one, three, four, five. And one. Two. Think oh, it had sorry, two and something. Chair. But, oh. oh, it was it wanted me to look at the chairs. Okay. Just so it could disappear. That's very clever. <laughs> 